If you want to upgrade from Windows 10 to Windows 11, but your PC doesn't currently meet the minimum system requirement, then in this video, I'll show you a simple trick that will let you skip the system requirement check and be able to install it. Let's begin. Open your browser and let's type Windows 11 ISO download in the search box. Click on the first link from Microsoft that says download Windows 11 Scroll down the page and click on the drop down menu that says select download. Choose Windows 11 multi edition ISO from the option. Then click on download. Select your preferred language from the product and click on confirm. Next, click on 64 bit download and the download process will begin. Now this file size is approximately 6.3 GB, so it might take some time to complete. Just be patient and wait until it's finished downloading. After downloading the ISO file is complete, let's open it, then choose extract to win 1123H2 English 64. I used WinRAR for this, if you don't have it, you need to install it or use any other file extractor tool. Once you've selected the extraction option, the process will begin. Now it might take some time, so just be patient. After the extraction is finished, a new folder named Windows 11 23H2 will be created, which contains the latest version. If you want to remove the ISO file, you can go ahead and delete it because it's no longer needed. Now open Windows 11 folder. Here you'll find a various installation files. Double click on the setup file, then click yes. And next, you may encounter a message saying your requirements are not met. Now to bypass this, let me show you this simple trick. Go to the source folder within Windows 11 folder. Look for a file name appraisers.dll and let's open it with notepad. So right click on it and choose open with notepad. Now let's delete everything in the file. And let's click on file and save and then close it. Now go back and double click on the setup file again and click yes to proceed with the installation. Follow the steps. And when asked about updating, click on change how setup download updates. Select not right now. Click next, then accept. It will check your PC. Now click on change what to keep. Now it's important to make sure to select keep personal files and applications to preserve your data. And finally click next and then install and just wait for the installation to finish. Now we've reached the Windows 11 login screen. Enter your password, which is the same as the one you used for Windows 10 and press enter. And it should start downloading the desktop. Please be patient while it completes the initialization process. You'll notice that our Windows 10 has now been successfully upgraded to Windows 11 without losing any data. All the files and wallpaper from our desktop are still there on our Windows 11 machine. And that was the simplest method to upgrade from Windows 10 to Windows 11 without having to meet the system requirements. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Bye for now. Thank you.